Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about Supergirl and a bit about Legends, and basically debunking some of the recent rumours that have been going around because there's a lot of fake rumours. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so if you guys are on Twitter, you would have seen like lots of articles, lots of tweets being like, oh shit, Supergirl and Legends are going to get cancelled, they could still get cancelled. And there's been loads of rumours going around saying, oh this person's going to be in crisis, they've been approached and so on and so forth. And all of this has been debunked and I'm going to go through it bit by bit, talk about it with you guys in this video. Because really, it's just a scumbag move, like to just try and get a few more viewers on your site or whatever, to create fake sources or very very unreliable sources that are far away from what's going on so yeah let's talk about this so the first bit of fake news comes from cosmic book news who you know don't trust them just don't follow them they have done many times they've done this but anyway so they posted this article saying that supergirl and legends could still get cancelled and they talk about how the viewer ratings have gone down and everything. They even include like a ratings chart. And you see the Supergirl chart, number one. We'll talk about the Supergirl chart just quickly before we go over what the title of this article is and what, you know, their actual news is because really there's no news. So they show a chart. Yeah, the viewership's gone down, but it's steady over a million. And for the CW, that's really good. That's, you know, top two or three in the whole network so there's no reason for Zupio to go away and also Flash TV News and the people that run all those sites they actually were at the TCAs and they got to talk to Mark Pedowitz the president of the CW and he was able to give some statements to various outlets and essentially one of the quotes not from Flash TV News but we'll talk about them in a sec um, Mark actually said we believe in these franchises this universe will continue for many many years and so, it's just the idea that they sort of piggyback off of the TCAs being like, ooh, look at the ratings, ooh, they're not as high as they were on CBS. Because if you guys don't know, CBS get mad ratings, and that's because CBS is one of the biggest networks. The CW is a subsidiary, like a sort of under network, owned by CBS and Warner Brothers. So, it's, you know not as big as CBS and they show the ratings how it started the first episode was at 30 million viewers which is you know humongous that is massive and bigger than the flash and then it went down and it went to about 6 million in season 1 and then it dropped that's because it's on the CW it's not on CBS it doesn't have as many eyes on it and then over you know season 2 3 and 4 it's yeah it's gone down a little bit but it's steady it's very steady, it's over a million, no need to worry about any of that. And so the title of the article, which is really misleading, is Supergirl and Legends of Tomorrow could still get cancelled. And they literally have no sources, they have nothing. So they talk about the CW's presentation at the upfront, at the, so, at the TCA, sorry, my bad. And he just quotes saying, Mark Pedowitz says, hopefully it'll be l a long time from now you know, whenever they ax these shows. And Mark literally said after that, we don't intend to end any of these shows. So essentially that article is just bullshit. It's just a way to get clicks and I highly recommend you don't click on it. I had to obviously for this video. So essentially, I just really hate this sort of fake news. We have had this the past few years. You remember when Supergirl uh, back in season three, when they had that long break Everyone reported on it, not everyone, like the unreliable sources reported, like we got this covered. They were all like, oh Supergirl's gonna get cancelled, we've heard rumours about this because it's on break for this long. But no, that's not the case, and it wasn't the case, and it's still not the case, that there are no negotiations, no talks, even, that Supergirl or Legends could get cancelled. And just because, you know, Legends is coming back later, Legends has dipped in ratings, Obviously, Legends didn't have such a good rating season last year. It wasn't too drastic. It was pretty much just a, you know, 100,000 drop or something, or about a 200,000 drop. So it wasn't anything too mad. So there was no reason 
to actually worry about this because there is no sources for this and it's just pure tosh. It's just rubbish. It's just literally nothing. It's just an article for the sake of trying to get a few clicks and that's about it. And so also another thing that was posted recently and this is from another unreliable source and I would say the biggest unreliable sources in sort of what we deal with with the TV shows you know websites that deal with the Arrowverse shows is definitely Cosmic But News and we got this covered and talking about Flash TV news earlier they actually w were really really vocal and I really like it and I give massive props to them for them actually calling out these sites and being like this is bullshit you, you know you're not sourcing anyone you haven't even dug anything up you've got no evidence to show any of this and it's just for clicks so big up flash tv news they're a really good site and yeah i just really really appreciate that you know when people call out this you know bullshit so yeah we got this covered so they posted a bunch of stuff on crisis and you know in the past like last year they had the rumors Oh, we have the confirmation from sources close to we got this covered. That is the dreaded words that, oh, Cisco is going to be leaving. What did we find out? Cisco's staying. He's a series regular. That's fake. And then they said Danielle Panabaker's leaving as Caitlin Snow. She's still a series regular. She's not leaving, is she? And then they said many times, oh, Arrow's leaving. Arrow's ending. And, oh, this got later confirmed. But that was them making it up. And it just so happened that a few months after, Stephen and Mel and the team sort of talked, you know, together and they were like, we think this is a good time to end, we've done this for eight years, nothing wrong about this. So, that was another bullshit thing, and also additionally, along with that, they have done it many times saying Supergirl and Legends are going to get cancelled, just like Cosmic Book News did just a few days ago, so they have a really bad track record and everyone knows you can't trust we got this covered. It's just the luck of the draw if they ever get anything right because they're just making up rumors. It's just literal rumors that need to be taken with the biggest grain of salt in the world, maybe like a beach full of salt. That's how much you need to take it. So anyway, so they talk about Crisis and recently they posted an article saying that Smallville's Lex Luthor is going to be appearing. Michael Rosenbaum has been approached. So they say... According to sources close to We Got This Covered, the same sources who told us Viola Davis was returning for Suicide Squad, Rosenbaum will be indeed bringing back his fan favourite Lex Luthor character, if only for a quick cameo. No details beyond that have been spilled just yet, but hopefully that will change soon. So people were able to talk to the showrunners and there has been nothing said about him coming back, there has been absolutely no talks. Michael actually called them out on Twitter and he was like, he tagged John Cryer and he was like, have you heard about this? Am I returning? So he obviously hasn't heard an anything and so it's bullshit once again. That is them lying about it, just making it up for the sake of some clicks. Also recently, back to Cosmic Book News, they released an article saying that Linda Carter is going to be returning. That's bullshit. Nothing has been said about that. Maybe she appears somehow, like just popping up as a cameo, but nothing has been confirmed to do with that. And additionally, they posted in that very same article that Tom Welling is going to be returning, and they've talked about Tom Welling, and Stevens talked about Tom Welling returning, that they want him to come, but they haven't even talked to him about it or anything like that. So that's, again, Cosmic But News, you know, being really unreliable and reporting. They actually said it was an exclusive on their side, which is mad because they have no sources. They literally have, like, one person and they say, oh, we have an exclusive. We have been told this by a reliable source very close to us. So the moral of this video is don't listen to these rumors. Wait until an official site like comicbook.com, TV Line, or anything like that until... You see, say, Supergirl.tv, really reliable. Flash TV News, really reliable. If it comes from any of those sources, or people with actual accreditation, then you can believe it. But for now, don't listen to We Got This Covered, don't listen to Cosmic Book News, because they are making it up. And they are spreading these false rumours that Supergirl and Legends are going to get cancelled, all these characters are going to appear in Crisis when nothing has been confirmed. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, 
So, sorry this was very ranty, but I felt like I had to get this out. I This is like my yearly thing with We Got This Covered. I swear to God, I swear I always have to make these videos. But anyway, guys, I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye. I see red.